Thank God, it's centenary, sustaining the vision. The Nigeria Centenary social media platforms were created shortly after President Goodluck and Bele Jonathan flagged off the centenary celebrations at the State House in February 2013. The essence was to get every Nigerian to be part of the centenary celebrations. Since then, the Nigeria Centenary social media platforms have continued to grow in leaps and bounds, month after month, and all these are reflected in their daily total reach. It is not surprising then that observers have described it as the fastest growing social media platform in Africa, especially among the youths as it has recorded millions of viewership and participation among Nigerians both at home and in the diaspora. Interestingly, the president of the National Youth Council of Nigeria at a courtesy visit to the coordinator of the Nigeria Centenary Social Media Platform pledged full and total support of over 80 million Nigerian youths under his organization. I want to congratulate you okay. and assure you that on our part, as the umbrella body and the most authoritative voice of Nigerian youths, okay. representing above 80 million young persons, oh. we will give you all the solidarity and support that this project requires. On top of this, Nigerian youths have sworn that the Nigeria Centenary Celebration will be second to none, knowing fully well that it is almost impossible to witness 200 years of bicentenary celebration. Members on these platforms have since shown an increased interest in everything Nigeria, including her history, current affairs, sports, agriculture, as well as news on the Nigerian economy. It has often been said that there is no platform like the Nigeria Centenary Social Media Platforms for unrivaled content. These platforms have not only been a source of useful content for our members, but also a source of information, education, and entertainment that other online platforms feed upon. Here are some testimonies from members. The Nigerian Centenary, through many of his uh, numerous competitions, has been a talent-provoking platform that has helped people to really discover their talents and also to have their voice in nation building. I want to say a very big thank you for bringing me and other Nigerian youth together on that one platform through the Nigerian Centenary Social Media Forum has really impacted positively to myself and other Nigerian youth at large. As an entrepreneur from Edo State with a fish farm in Abakali Airport in State Nigeria, the Nagropedua Digest News has been my driving force towards making my fish farm world class. The joy of sharing ideas constructively with fellow Nigerian youth, Bora Roman in diaspora, has been a source of joy to me. I am proud and blessed to be a member of the Nigeria Centennial Community. God bless the Nigeria Centennial Community. God bless the Nigeria Centennial Social Media Team. Although I have not won any award, I encourage all to subscribe to this page, not for material gains, but for its numerous intangible benefits. All of these have come about because on a daily basis, the various platforms are expertly managed by a tireless team of social media enthusiasts and professionals working from the Centenary Secretariat who ensure that there is no dull moment round the clock. Hour after hour, visitors to the online platforms of the Nigeria Centenary are treated to the most educating, the most informative, and the most engaging news, updates, and topics about the centenary celebrations, about Nigeria's history, about entrepreneurship virtues, and the noteworthy accomplishments of Nigerians across the globe. Beyond being a source of information, education, and entertainment, more Nigerians are being united. On the centenary platforms, long-lasting friendships have been formed, many of which are transferred into real life. In essence, we are connecting many more Nigerians across various divides, cultural, religious, and physical, both online and offline. This is in line with a key mission of the centenary celebration, which is to re-inspire our unity in our diversity. Salami Taiwo Ramon, a regular member of the Centennial community, have this to say. 
I believe the love and unity we share on this Nigeria Centenary platform will go a long way one day in erasing the issues of zoning, federal character, state of origin, and other irrelevant issues that have kept dividing us as a nation. I foresee tomorrow's president, vice president, legislators, secretary to the government of the federation, governors, ministers, and top national leaders coming out of this centennial community. A platform like this is surely one that restores patriotism, unity, and national consciousness devoid of tribal or sectional sentiment. I am Nigeria. Nigeria is me. The bonds being established among this generation of Nigerians will surely impact positively on Nigeria in the near future. These bonds will seal whatever cracks may be evident in the Nigeria of today and help guarantee a more united and progressive future for our dear country. It is equally important to note that some members have been gainfully employed while others have been made entrepreneurs by consistently following leaks and update, we share about various opportunities in Nigeria. I was so happy, so happy that she went to the village, she went to August meeting and she was telling people, she made testimony and even the market place, if she was telling people that my son got a job from Nigeria City on Facebook, you know, people were so surprised that how Facebook were employing me. My mom was so happy. My mom now is now a Centenary ambassador. Ah, she goes, she tells people that good Facebook or tell your son to go there, my son got a, a job oh, happy and this Facebook page has dropped the bond between me and my mom. My mom always loved the history notes. Sometimes I would meet her to tell me some questions and my mom was so so happy for me, you know, having a son who graduated like four years, two thousand um, seven. In two recent two weeks, no job. the social media so, teams so have increased the tempo of their offline activities. They have focused their attention and sensitization campaigns on secondary schools with appreciable results. At the last count, the teams have visited 15 secondary schools in the federal capital, imparting the centenary message on the students as they do. This singular act is helping to inform a much younger generation of Nigerians who desire to know more about the history of their fatherland. The feedbacks have been inspiring, and though the sensitization visits have begun in Abuja, the teams will move further afield, reaching out to more states of the Federation in the months leading up to the centenary celebrations. The journey of transformation continues, and having come this far, now is not the time to stop, but a time to sustain the vision. Your Excellency, sir, are children also part of the Nigeria centenary celebrations, or is it only meant for adults? Because I am Nigeria, and Nigeria is me. Me Nigeria, Nigeria, me. I'm from Nigeria, Nigeria. We are Nigeria.